Trail closed. Could it be because the river's there? <laughs> and it is kind of in the spring flood phase. That way takes you over to Burma Road, which is mainly what I'm exploring today, and I'll be heading back soon. This is the side trail that brings you to the edge of the Neponset River and all its spring high flood stage glory. The amphibians are sight. The blackbirds are inclined to concur. Everything is psyched in the spring. <clears throat> now this trail, this little trail, I'm going to come back and check sometime. This is on the state DCR map. This particular property is kind of jumbled in with the rest of Blue Hills. It's called the Fowl Meadow section. But that looks to be a killer trail. And I should probably explore it soon before the mosquitoes start really hatching. But for now, I'm gonna head back to Burton. Ponds it, roll on. Some kind of helicopter in the background. And the railroad line to Sharon and ultimately New York City in Providence is right on the other side of those trees. their enthusiasm. Salamanders seem to prefer stealth. At least given the little I know of, of them. And you can also hear the roar of motors to, which suggests isn't that far away. Thank you. 
species of ways in. Impressively extensive here. Looks like we got poison ivy curling up. See, this is one of the great reasons to be out this time of year. It may not be very colorful compared to other seasons, but there's no mosquitoes. Poison ivy. And it's a nice kind of midway between the austerity of <coughs> winter and the madcap complexity of May and June. This is the all-important connector trail for the Blue Hills. And probably I'll get my friend Mike here again soon and we'll make sense of that. It was funny that I, the person I talked to actually knows the bicycle advocate that's part of my Google Plus community, Lee Toma. She immediately identified him as the bicycle guy. So Lee, if you end up watching this, I'm here in Milton and you have been bagged as the bicycle guy. Good Lord, what a fate. That's okay, I'm sure there could be worse epithets heard hurled your way. <laughs> That's cool though. <laughs> One of the reasons I'm doing this is to help the bicycle community have greater resource options for looking at these places. 